हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल डेरी पाठशाला योर वन स्टॉप सॉल्यूशन फॉर ऑल द सब्जेक्ट्स रिलेटेड टू डेरी साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी तो पिछले वीडियो में हमने देखा रिगार्डिंग द सिलेबस ऑफ डेरी साइंस एज अ मेजर सब्जेक्ट फॉर द आईसीआर एग्जाम फॉर पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट इन दिस वीडियो हम देखेंगे पीजी सिलेबस फॉर द मेजर सब्जेक्ट डेरी टेक्नोलॉजी तो पिछले वीडियो में हमने देखा था डेरी साइंस के बारे में जहां पे हमने बात करी थी कि देर आर टू सब सब्जेक्ट डेरी माइक्रोबायोलॉजी एंड डेरी केमिस्ट्री एंड इस वीडियो में हम बात करेंगे डेरी टेक्नोलॉजी एज अ मेजर सब्जेक्ट के बारे में जहां पे हमें दो सब्जेक्ट के सिलेबस uh, से डील करना पड़ता है ड्यूरिंग अवर बैचलर्स डेरी टेक्नोलॉजी एंड डेरी इंजीनियरिंग तो हम देखते हैं यूनिट वन जहां पे हमको कवर uh, करना है प्रिंसिपल्स एंड प्रोसेसेस ऑफ फूड प्रजर्वेशन व्हाट आर द नॉन कन्वेंशनल सोर्सेज फॉर दिस देन प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ फ्लूड मिल्क व्हाट आर द कंप्यूटराइजेशन एंड ऑटोमेटिक प्रोसेसेस कंट्रोल्स इन मिल्क प्रोसेसिंग एच एस सी सी पी कॉन्सेप्ट इन फ्लूड मिल्क प्रोसेसिंग दस इज हेजार्ड एनालिसिस एंड क्रिटिकल कंट्रोल पॉइंट विच इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन टर्म्स ऑफ क्वालिटी कंट्रोल एंड एश्योरेंस देन What are the advances in centrifugal separation and back to fugation? Then manufacture of various types of dairy products. So here, we are talking about technological aspects. We are talking about the process of designing every product. And what are the changes occurring during manufacture and storage of storage of these products and the and their defects? Then we will talk about sensory evaluation and judging of milk and milk products. what are the types of packaging material and their properties on basis of which uh, each packaging material is selected for different product then packaging forms and operations what are the problems in food packaging and what are the recent advances in packaging of dairy and food products and also we'll see we have to cover intelligent food packaging nutritional labeling of food product and application of membrane processing in milk प्रोसेसिंग इन यूनिट टू हम देखेंगे मटेरियल एंड सैनिटरी फीचर्स ऑफ डेरी इक्विपमेंट देन वी विल सी अबाउट डिफरेंट इक्विपमेंट वॉट आर यूज इन डेरी इंडस्ट्री सो फर्स्ट वन इज होमोजेनाइजर सो वॉट इज थ्योरी ऑफ होमोजेनाइजेशन अबाउट ट्रिप्लेक्स पंप लिबिक्रेशन ऑफ होमोजेनाइजर हाउ टू टेक केयर एंड मैनेजमेंट ऑफ homogenizer and then homogenizer accessories and what are the standards for homogenizer our next most important equipment is pasteurizer so we have to see the pasteurizer construction and the principal materials used in the construction of pasteurizers stst pasteurizer and how to take care of pasteurizer what are the reaction kinetics which goes on through the processing and then sterilizers and equipments related to mixing and agitation what is the what are the principles of evaporation drying what is atmospheric concentration what is the function of vacuum pan what is fluidization how to maintain vacuum pan what is atmospheric drum dryer what is spray, spray dryer what are the principles of dairy plant layout and design what is functional design what is the space requirement if you want to construct a dairy plant then problem solving through computers centralized dispersal of data processing and some details regarding data processing like dbase 3 lotus 1 2 3 to graphics etc and in the last unit we will see about fluid mechanics uh, properties of fluid because our main ingredient here is milk which is a fluid in itself so what is fluid what are its properties and then equations like bernoulli's equation what are its applications in our industry what are hydraulic systems and then types of pumps sanitary pumps what are the different standards which are used for centrifugal and positive rotatory types of pumps and on what basis we select different types of pumps for different purposes then care and upkeep of pumps dimensional analysis this refrigeration and air conditioning artificial refrigeration what is compression refrigeration system refrigeration accessories then how to calculate the size of refrigeration machine requirements and then heat transfer and thermodynamics what is mechanical separation 
on different laws like Rittinger's laws, Kick's law, and then engineering of mechanics. What is theory of machine? What is common strength of materials? Different laws like Hooke's law and material of fabrications. What are machine tools? Electrical engineering. Then also we have to cover electromagnetic induction in our syllabus along with magnetic hysteresis loop which is also called as BH curves and some fundamentals related to alternative current. So with this we will end this video. So in this video we have covered the syllabus of the major subject group dairy technology. So basically you have to cover uh, all your topics in your bachelors which are related to dairy technology and uh, dairy engineering and this is more specified uh, actually what they ask and in the upcoming videos we will also upload the uh, information regarding how to start your preparations what are the books which are necessary for each subject group if you are preparing for dairy science what are the books you should consider for dairy microbiology and dairy chemistry if you are preparing for dairy technology group so what is the study material that you should focus on for dairy technology as well as dairy uh, engineering and then uh, continuously we will try to upload uh, videos regarding all the subjects so there is a playlist on our channel uh, related to different subjects like dairy engineering dairy technology dairy microbiology also and also if you want to know more about dairy technology, how it functions, what is the journey through uh, your bachelor, so you can watch the expert insight also in our playlist. Till until the next video, uh, keep liking our content and also please share and subscribe to our channel Dairy Partshala. Thank you.